All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Dude, it's a king, it's a king. Ooh. Morning, Jetty Rockers. Welcome back to Jetty Rocks Fishing. Well, we're out here this morning. We got Terry on the boat again. And also, we got Summer. We have 100 live shrimp, you know, hopes and dreams, and all kinds of stuff. So hopefully we are going to catch something good today. Got a little bit of a strong west wind, so I don't know how far we can get out. But our plan is to get out on the reefs, see if we can't catch some nice lane snapper, and maybe go a little bit deeper to a wreck, see if we can't get some amberjack. And that's the plan, y'all. Wish us luck. y'all well we're gonna have a little detour we we're heading out the inlet and we see some shrimp boats we got one here we got two down there so we're gonna see if we can boat a, a shark real quick throw it on just this side of the prop wash yeah go ahead perfect they just let it drift That was awesome. Dolphins are definitely out. All right, guys. Well, total change of plans. It's a little sloppy to try to go offshore. It's nice and calm here because we're up close to the beach. Got a really strong northwest wind. So we're going to try some shark fishing this morning. We'll give this an hour sitting here at the shark spot. And then we're going to go do some more shrimp boat fishing because there's Two more shrimp boats out here. We already tried one with no luck, but goal today is now sharks. It's funny how quick things change. We went from AJ's and bottom fish now to sharks. First one on, real fast, real fast, real fast. Is he off? No, he's not off. Yeah, he's off. I think so. Let's see. No, he's not. Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Go around the bow. Go around the bow. Okay. Be careful up there. Good. We got it. All right. First shark on. We've only been here five minutes. Let's see what flavor we got. He ain't fighting real good. Oh, he's a dead beast. Oh, that's a sharp nose. You want one this size, Terry? Or you want to wait for a bigger one? Yeah, let's, let's try to get a bigger. He's small. Bigger one. All right. All right. We'll let this one go. There's a bait. You can grab that bait if you can. All right. Summer just saved the bait. Let it come back up. Let it come back up. Oh, gosh. <clears throat> I got gotcha. you. I got you. Come here. Come here. See my pliers anywhere, Summer? Thank you. Come on, buddy. All right. All right. First sharp nose. See you there, buddy. All right. Good job, Summer. All right, guys. Well, that was pretty quick. We only been here, not even really set up yet, and we already got a shark. We decided to let that one go, see if we can get a couple bigger ones. Really would like to get some black noses or some really large sharp nose. But we'll keep at it. All right, trout. 
and we're going to keep these today. A little fish fry, and there's no size limit on these little silver trout. Some people call them sugar trout. A little silver trout. Not a weak, that's not an actual weak fish. That's a little bit different species. There's no size limit and no bag limit. So we got another trout. There you go. Put him in the box. They got little teeth. Summer's wearing them out. Wearing them out. Summer's just tearing them up, y'all. Tearing them up. You're gonna lose him like you lost that lane the other day. <laughs> Terry, she's out fishing you, buddy. Yeah, I know. It's like it's like seven to two. <laughs> we got another one. Yeah, they're cool looking fish though. They are, he's pretty. And they are cool fish. Uh, you can tell the difference. Some people call them sand trout, some people call them sugar trout, some people call them silver trout. But it's one of the three trout species we have here in Florida. The speckled trout, the weak fish, and then this guy. Very tasty little fish. I think the purples and stuff on the frame are pretty oh, cool. Oh yeah, they're awesome little fish. They don't get much bigger than that. That's about as big as I've ever seen. This is what we're looking at, guys. That right there, all that red, that's all silver trout. That's how thick they get. When you find them, oh, look at that. He's hooked up. When you find them, you will absolutely wear them out. Big old school of them. Hey, guys, here's another species we get here. You don't get them off, real often, but we do catch them. That is called a stripe drum. Kind of an odd looking fish. We're putting on a clinic over here, y'all. She is just as fast as she absolutely drops it. She's got a fish. She's literally gonna fill the box. Oh, Terry's got one. There we go. And she's on again. That's a wow, that's actually a big one right there, Summer. That's a really good one. Yeah, that's a real good one. We're just getting a pile of these things. Oh, if we can get him up, I'll stick him. Get him up, I'll stick him. He had a little trout, and a barracuda just came and stuck his trout. And you got this a little tiny thing. Got a one alt hook in it. Well, if you can get him up. Oh, well, you know I'm gonna fight him. Yeah, just take your time with him. That's a good eating size cuda too. That's probably what was happening. You getting guys were getting broke off. Yeah. The cuda was doing that. Summer, when he comes up to the side, walk down that way because I don't want him to jump in the boat. Could it jump in the boat? It very well could, yeah. Possibility? Very, oh, yeah. yeah. The kudos are notorious for it, Summer. It will skyrocket like a kingfish. Yep. Like it looked like it was a pretty decent sized kuda. Oh, I hope he don't get around that anchor line. I'm trying to find it. Oh, he turned. If you actually manage this, that would be pretty awesome. Little one out hook, little six pound test line. Uh, oh my God. Nah, <laughs> I don't think it's gonna happen. Uh, you got a 40 pound leader? No, I went down to 15. 15 pound leader with a one out hook, no steel whatsoever, and he's got a barracuda on. That is the craziest thing. <laughs> that'd be the fish of the day though if you get him catching him on that 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 don't get no better is he staying away from that anchor 
Oh no. They passed it, they passed it. They went over it? Yeah. Okay, good. They... Summer, reel this in. Might want to tighten the drag, honey. You'll be able to see that red, that red arm. Wait, he's got about four foot of leader behind that. Wait. All right. Oh, don't go under the boat. All right, good. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. Dude, it's a king, it's a king. It's a king. You've got to be kidding me. Dude, on, on that little teeny line. Dude. Don't fight me, kingfish. Dude. <laughs> Look at this, y'all. This is like little tiny, we're fishing for little weak fish. And we were just talking about the Benitas hitting us. Yeah, those big kings come in when that happens. <laughs> oh my gosh. I was like, that doesn't look like a barracuda. No. That was, wow, bro. <laughs> wow. And that's a big king. That is the fish of the day. Look, look, oh, I want to see this. Pick, pick his head up. Look at this, y'all. Look at this little hook. Look how you hooked him. Look at that, guys. A little one on hook. Holy cow. All right, let me get this off. That's a, almost, almost a 20 pounder. Oh, yeah. High five, Summer, just for cuz. Do what? That's a high five, Summer, just for cuz. Yeah. <laughs> that is insane, bro. <laughs> oh my goodness. All right, dude, that's a nice fish, man. That's a good king, buddy. <laughs> that's a good one. Y'all, I am still in utter disbelief and shock right now. That is an awesome king by any standards. I, don't, I mean, by people trolling, flatlining for him. That is an awesome king. But to catch it on a little tiny bait rod with 15 pound test leader and a one-aught hook and not get broke off or cut off, my mind is blown. Uh, we might have a shark here. We might have a shark. We just got a nice king. And what we got here? We got sharp nose, he's going home. <laughs> All righty. <laughs> wow, 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 what a day. Got him. All right. Finally got the target. But boy, we got a bonus. Dude, I tell you what. We got a bonus. Finally got the target, but we got a bonus. Awesome. We're going to keep this one. That's an Atlantic sharp nose. And that's a good eating little shark. All right. We still got blood on the deck from the king because yep. we just put the king in the box. Then we got a box full of doggone trout. Oh my gosh. There we go. <laughs> I got a hold of her for dear life, y'all. We got him in. Oh boy. That was a heck of a day. Probably might make two videos out of this this day. With the shark, all the whole footage of summer catching that shark. I don't even know what to say. I'm still I'm still in awe over this whole day. The king mackerel. 
the shark is just an epic day y'all and i'm so glad you guys got to check it out and see that because those right there both of them are stories that nobody would believe unless it was on film insane summer is a champ well thank you guys very much for watching the video hope you guys enjoyed it until we see y'all again guys thank you so much hit that subscribe button if you haven't yet and that bell for notifications and we'll check you all next time